backstage at Versace and it's just all about a beautiful, glowing, healthy, gorgeous girl. But there's a nod to punk and you can see a black eyeliner only inside on the underneath the eyes, tons of mascara top and bottom, perfectly groomed brows and a little bit of a blush on lips. and makeup here at Versace. Beautiful as always. The makeup's fairly simple. The hair is definitely a lot more boyish. I think it's beautiful. It comes together great with the clothes and everything. Very Donatella, it's got that rock and roll kind of feeling. It's got a little like boyish feeling as well, this sort of comb gelled bit in the front, but beautiful and luxurious in the back, so a very Versace girl at heart. It's not too overdone, it's kind of simple look, but still just the right amount to still look cool. Beautiful eye makeup and beautiful hair. Just like a little thing in the eye, a little line underneath and a little twist in the hair. Nice and easy in the back. Wow, Donatella was on a trip to some place where girls have a lot of fun and I wish I was there right now. It was all out Versace and I like it when a designer sticks to what they do and kind of absolutely goes for it. It was an amazing show for Donatella. It was great, it was so her. It may be a bit of me, but it's a lot of her too. I'm wearing an amazing black dress, and it has a little cutout detail, almost like a safety pin, but it's tight. So it's like kind of sexy punk. Mm. I really like it. I'm wearing a skin tight sexy dress with these like incredible like metal work in it that are kind of like nails and pins and stuff which are a theme on a lot of the clothes. It's really beautiful, really sexy of course. a message for a more youthful Versace customer. She took all the brand um, symbols, things that it's known for. It's a very visual collection. Each garment was so visual. You could look at it, you could imagine it as an icon or as a little image on a website. And you would know exactly what you're getting. It's classic, it's minimalist, but it's also got a little bit of jazz. A shiny yellow dress. The necklace is attached. And it's like shiny silver things coming out. Very nice. The plaids at the beginning, the little kilt, the little safety pin, sex, sex, sex. The yellow coat with the animal print, the white coat with the animal print. I mean, these coats are heavenly. They are meant to be noticed. Leave it to 
Donatella to rename Punk Vunk by way of Versace. <laughs> Latex pants, then a top which is almost like a bra with beautiful pieces on it, and then a coat just put on my shoulders. Everything was infused with, you know, safety pins and hardware and those kind of acid bright colors and cutouts and you know, it was all body consciousness by way of punk rock and you know nobody else would even attempt to do that, you know, so I think she had a lot of fun with it. Exactly the sort of girl I want to go home with tonight. My posh punk fantasy girl, all in plastic and spikes. Who would not want to go out with her? The punk was the best part of it because it was just in your face sexy dresses. Not easy to be chic and to be punkish, but it was perfect. I ordered already two evening dress, one skirt, one t-shirt, and I made my comment already. Gowns at the end. Oh, yeah, oh my yeah. goodness. This show was one of her best. Oh, yeah.